In this video I want to take a look at redundancy and maternity leave. I've had a question or two in the last little while about this. An employee on maternity leave is on what's called or known as protective leave and cannot have her contract of employment terminated. This protection applies to any purported redundancy. And Section 23 of the Maternity Protection Act, as you can see in the screen there, provides that certain purported terminations of employment are actually void. So each of the following shall be void, as you can see there. A. Any purported termination of an employee's employment while the employee is absent from work on protective leave and maternity leave is protective leave. B. Any purported termination of an employer's employee's employment during a period of natal care absence. Any purported termination during a period of absence from work to attend antenatal classes. Any termination, purported termination, during a period of absence from work for breastfeeding. Any notice of termination of an employee's uh, termination, uh, employee's employment being terminated while the employee is absent from work on protective leave is void. Any notice uh, of termination of an employee's employment given during a period of natal care absence and expiring subsequent to such a period. So the notice itself is uh, unlawful or void. So you can see there any a purported termination arising from maternity leave and other related protective leaves are void. Any purported terminations are void from the get-go. And that is the black and white position. So employees on maternity leave should not even be served with a notice of termination. Termination of an employee on or going on maternity leave can only be terminated when they return to work after the maternity leave has expired or before the maternity leave commences. Even an employee who is agreeable to a satisfactory and perhaps attractive voluntary termination by reason of redundancy cannot be terminated during the maternity leave. Notice of termination of the employment by reason of redundancy can only run before maternity leave starts or after it has been completed and the usual obligations in respect of redundancy continue to apply. For example, the redundancy must be genuine and unrelated to the pregnancy and the employer must behave reasonably and fairly and adopt fair procedures in affecting any redundancy. My website employmentrightsireland.com, you see the See it on the screen there, employmentrightsireland.com is a good resource for free information about employment law in Ireland. You may be interested in checking it out, employmentrightsireland.com. If you find this video useful, I'd appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up down below. And if you're watching it on podcast or listening to it on podcast, the Irish Law and Small Business podcast, which is available on iTunes, Spotify, etc., YouTube, then I'd appreciate if you left a review for me. Thanks a lot.